Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad that you're here. Welcome to everybody who is newly subscribed and thank you again to those who continue to watch my videos and leave lovely comments. I do appreciate it. I am going to show you today a couple of um, embellishments that I've been working on and have finished. So these are more fun since I did the big project and I actually will have that video uh, up shortly as well. So I did all the video, everything's been done. I just wanted to wait till my partner received her um, uh, her gatefold box and she's received it. So I want to uh, put that video up. But anyway, um, so afterwards it was a pretty big project and I wanted to start on just some little things. I also decided to uh, participate in some swaps this month. And um, so I'm gonna try to get those done. So I'm trying to get back into the groove of doing little swaps. But first of all, what I, and these are really small things, what I created or what I did is I used the KS Craft die. And this one is going to be the spider um, die, or spider web die, bow die. <laughs> so you have it here, you have this one here, and then this guy here, which I think is really, I really like this. Um, so that's the die that I used, and here are the bows. And every one of the bows is threaded through except for one. I actually put thread around is what I mean. So this one's more of an iridescent thread. This one's a black shiny thread. And again, it has that really pretty um, pink paper, glitter paper, and then the black glitter paper in the back. And then here is another one. I decided for this one to go ahead and uh, put a gem in the middle and then I just switched it with here and here is another one this one I went ahead and wrapped it with the glow-in-the-dark thread that I purchased off of Timo so that'll be fun once it's in the dark that it would glow that it's going to glow here is another one this is from the Luna collection and it is the ghosts they're really cute and then we have the gold spiderweb in the back. And then this last one is going to be the paper collection in the back and then the gold um, paper and wrapped around with uh, the pink ribbon. So I thought those were fun and I wanna send those out with some swaps that I have. And then this one, I actually found the design, it's a ribbon and I found it on the Cricut Access, um, the Cricut Access like designs where they have all the different designs. I did find this one, it's a ribbon. And what I did is I used some of the, the plastic vinyl and I purchased this, here it is right here. I purchased this off of Amazon probably some time ago and haven't used it and thought this would be a great time to go ahead and use it. So I made like this here, I put that all together. I actually had to sew it because I think glue gunning it probably wasn't going to keep it because it is plastic. So I had to sew each of those in there. And then I went ahead and used the pink eyelash trim. And then here's the black glitter. And then I used a little bit more of that vinyl down here. And then I have a little shaker witch's hat. And I thought that turned out really cute. The witch's hat is actually another die from KS Craft. And it's this one. So it comes with like the little brim. I didn't use this part. Instead, I just used a little spider. So again, something really simple and really fun. I thought that I could go ahead and put it on my pencil holder here. Or actually, these are all of my pokey holders. So I can place it on there and it can be a little decoration um, just to kind of liven up my craft room a little bit. So that is all that I have for right now. I hope that everybody has a great day and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.